So Dell reached out wanting to sponsor a video to raise awareness around Dell Outlet, their website that sells refurbished and overstock products at discounted prices. I agreed to take on the project because I'm a long time fan of buying things that aren't completely brand new to save money. I've showcased this plenty of times over the years with secondhand PC parts I've picked up and I've bought a lot of official refurbished products over the years from online retailers as well. There's not a single bone in my body that has a negative stigma towards secondhand electronics and hardware. Most of the time I talk about how nice it is to save money buying used or refurbished, but there are other important benefits which I feel like more and more people are talking about and getting on board with, and that's the contributions towards being environmentally responsible. When you buy something used or refurbished, you are giving it a second chance and prolonging the life of that product, getting more use out of it, keeping it from becoming e-waste that ends up in landfills. This right here is one of the products found on Dell Outlet's website. It's an Alienware M15 gaming laptop. And Dell wanted me to unbox it and inspect this to show you the quality of their refurbished products. So I do have the overhead cam here set up and I can't switch between the two cameras, but if we take a quick look at the box, this is not the original packaging that the laptop came with when it was brand new. If we look at the back side here, it does say medium notebook right there. So this is a generic repackaging. If we take a look at the side here, we do have a like new refurbished designation on this specific laptop itself. Like new is a more positive way to convey something is refurbished. The words refurbished and used tends to have a negative stigma, so they are trying to shift the mindset describing it as like new. Uh, but let's get this thing opened up. All right, inside the box we do have the charger, the power brick, and the cords that comes with it. And then we have the laptop itself, which is attached to this cardboard that is shrunk wrap. We'll get this box out of the way now. So we're gonna remove it from this shrink wrap here now. So let's take a look at the laptop here, which, oh, let me flip it over and pull this foam sheet out. So here's the laptop, which upon initial inspection looks pretty pristine. This is one of their like new refurbish, so it's not likely going to have any scratches or dings on it, which they do have a different classification for those laptops for bigger discounts from. Looking at the bottom here, it does have the designation as refurbished from Dell Outlet right there with that sticker. I'll get better B-roll as well with closer up shots of the quality of everything, but yeah, everything looks new. Very good condition. I'll get shots on all sides of it right here, but then show more B-roll as well. Let me get this plugged in real quick so I can power it on. Yeah, for the charging brake, also pretty much pristine. So now I just need to go through the setup. Let me do that real quick. Yeah, so the keyboard pretty much looks untouched. The touchpad, there's no signs of wear or anything. This pretty much seems like a brand new laptop except without the official packaging. Right now it's really quiet, which is a little bit surprising for me because uh, I, I have a couple of laptops. Even on boot up, uh, the fans usually spool up. Right now, this is pretty much, it's pretty much seems like it's running on silent. Obviously it's not gonna be the case once we load up with like uh, heavy programs or games like that. But I do like on boot up that it's pretty much making no noise. So in terms of the specs of this laptop, I'll put it all on the screen, but what we essentially have is a 10th gen i7 mobile processor from Intel paired with an RTX 3070. There's half a terabyte SSD in here, 16 gigabytes of RAM, and the screen is 144 hertz with G-Sync. This has very impressive specs and it is discounted quite a bit on Dell Outlet. There's another version that's newer than this because this is the Alienware uh, M15 R4. There's an R5 version which does have a Ryzen 7 processor in it. When I looked at the pricing not too long ago, it was less than $1,300 for a Ryzen 7 like current gen processor with an RTX 3070, very beefy, capable, powerful graphics card. That's pretty impressive given the price. 
All right, so we are in now, and this also has Windows 11 ready to go. I'm actually using Windows 10 on my own personal system, so uh, this is gonna be awesome to experience Windows 11 for the first time. Okay, so I got this all set up, but what I really wanna do is open this up and see what's under the hood. So let me shut this down, and we're gonna see what the refurbishment process did to the inside of the laptop in terms of cleaning it and all of that. All right, so I'm gonna unplug that. Get it flipped over and get this opened. All right, so we got the cover off. Taking a closer look at the fans and just the motherboard itself. Uh, not seeing any signs of dust or anything like that. I guess I'd, I have no idea of knowing how old or how used this was when it was either returned or had issues and had to be RMA'd or anything like that, but um, in terms of if a customer bought this under the like new, I would say this is very fitting of that description. Like I think if you were to show me this laptop and a brand new one in like a blind test and I had to look side by side, I don't think I would be able to tell that uh, this one was the refurbished one. So this does have a like a heat sink or a thermal plate for one of the M.2 SSDs. Uh, but if you wanted to expand and put another one in, there's another M.2 slot over here that is open. So I did ask my campaign representative more about the details of how Dell refurbishes their products because they really emphasize the like new condition. I'm told that they go through a very comprehensive and meticulous repair and inspection process to ensure that all the refurbished systems meet the exact same standards as a new product would. They're checked to make sure that they include all the correct components and accessories. Like for this case, it's really easy because all you have is the laptop and then you have the charging cable and the power brick. After that, they're tested rigorously to make sure they're functioning as intended. And if there are any issues for whatever reason, they do make the necessary replacements and repairs until they reach that standard of a new product. If there's any storage devices, those are completely wiped to ensure that there's no data from the previous user that's left over. Uh, and the hardware is closely inspected for cosmetic damage to follow their criteria to categorize it as either like, like new or like a scratch and dent model. Anything that is scratch and dent is only cosmetic and it doesn't affect the performance. So at quick glance, everything looks really good to me. I'm gonna get this laptop set up with Steam as well as a bunch of other programs so I could benchmark it and check out the performance, make sure everything is okay in terms of the thermal side of things. The great thing about editing is I can fast forward in time and show you the results from that right now. One thing that I do want to highlight about Dell Outlet over other refurbished or open box products that I've bought in the past from other retailers is how much they back their refurbishing process. Their products, whether it's overstocked, new and unused, uh, like new refurbished or scratch and dent, they all come with the exact same warranty that they offer for their brand new products. So even though these aren't brand new, they are treated as if they were brand new with regards to the warranty. I've bought a number of refurbished things over the years and most of them cap 
cap their warranties at 90 days, which is three months. But Dell, on the other hand, like for example, this laptop, it gives you that full one year warranty that a brand new version of this laptop would also get. Uh, and one year warranty is a pretty standard baseline warranty for new laptops, regardless of brand. You can pay for more extended warranties beyond that, but uh, for the most part, one year is what you should expect. Now you may be thinking to yourself, I build my own computers, why should I care about this? Well, I build my own systems too. I've been doing it for years, but Dell Outlet has a lot of other product categories that may still be useful to you if the discount is good enough. They've got laptops, desktop, office workstations, monitors, servers, storage solutions, need a basic laptop for the grandparents so that they can video chat with the grandkids, or maybe your parents need like an email and bills paying machine, or maybe you need an HTPC for your living room. Check out Dell Outlet. They may have something that fits those needs. On any given day for any given product SKU, there may be multiple listing types that will vary in price. And you can get further savings by checking out their deal section where you can stack both the outlet discount and additional coupon codes on top of it. The filtering system also makes it very easy to browse and find exactly what you're interested in. You can sort by general use case, processor generation, specific graphics card model, which is what I like to do. And also if you're like me and you like to try to get the biggest discounts ever, you can look specifically at their scratch and dent inventory. I'm the type of person that would be all over the scratch and dent stuff. Like, please give me a blemish product for a good discount. I know my clumsy self would have eventually scratched and dinged it up anyways. So thank you for getting that step out of the way for me and saving me money in the process. But yeah, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. I'm really impressed by Dell's refurbished process. Uh, for the discount that they give for how clean this came, this is, this is pretty much like brand new. If you're not a stickler for knowing that it was used at one point before or needed to be repaired, um, then this is as good as new. I'm really curious though, what are your thoughts on refurbished products? Are you like me who fully embraces them and loves that discount? Or are you someone who prefers buying brand new whenever possible and doesn't mind paying the full price? Let me know down in the comments below. I'm curious what the split is. Uh, other than that though, I hope you found this video either helpful or informative. I wanna thank Dell and Dell Outlet for sponsoring this. I wanna thank you all as always for watching and a huge thanks to the channel members for their above and beyond support. Be safe out there and I will see you all down in the comments as well as in the next video and or stream. Bye.